I'm uh, Dave Rurick. Uh, this is Bodacious Dream, number 118, uh, Class 40 series. It's a Bruce Farr design uh, Kiwi built boat from Wellington, New Zealand. And uh, this is our second year in the Atlantic Cup. We were here last year for our very first race. My co skipper, Matt Charles, uh, will be sailing with me again this year. Matt is not here right at the moment, and a lot of these guys know Matt from last year and all and want to know when he's coming in. And, and uh, the challenges with the, the Atlantic Cup is it's right here in May, and Matt spends a, a significant amount of his time farming. In, uh, in Michigan, near Kalamazoo, Michigan. And this year has been particularly challenging for them uh, with the weather season. We've had a lot of rain back there. The fields have been very wet. And Matt's been, Matt's been working real hard and struggling real long days to get, uh, get his crops in. Probably the biggest challenge of this whole thing is gonna be picking the right pathway through the uh, changing weather as we go up the coast. The, one of the things that really throws an interesting twist in the whole thing is that you're allowed to only take eight sails. So you have to make some adjustments and decisions on which sails you wanna make, but to take but those eight sails, what you have to sail the long leg from here to New York, the short leg from New York to Newport, and then the inshore series in Newport, Rhode Island as well. So uh, there's some trade-offs in there, and, and uh, you have to make it, it's going to take a little bit of creative thinking to get the right set of sails that works well over all three courses since hey, we can't see too far into the future. And, uh, oops, can you excuse me for a second? These guys yeah. are taking off here. We're going to help these guys get around the uh, boat here. Really a group effort. We're all competitors, but we're all uh, we all look out for each other as well. You see, see uh, these hotshot guys here. Have, uh, they act like they've been around the world before, or something like that. <laughs> kind of like running a front of a sports car on the harbor. A bodacious dream here. Um, you know, they asked me why sh why should you vote for us to be the favorite boat. And uh, I'm not sure I have a good reason for that, but uh, uh, we're just, I'm just an old guy, you know, just in my, my waning years of my life, pleading for your mercy and pleading for your uh, attention. So if you see, see fit in yourself to take pity on an old guy and make him feel good in the last few uh, waning years of his life, vote, vote for Bodacious Dream. We're a good boat. Thanks a lot.